ever wondered if the mighty Triceratops, a dinosaur that roamed the Earth millions of years ago, lived alone or in groups? This has been a topic of hot debate among paleontologists for years, with many views formed and reformed based on the fossil evidence available. For a long time some believed that these three-horned giants were solitary creatures, roaming the lush Cretaceous landscapes alone. However, recent fossil discoveries have painted a different picture. These findings point towards the possibility that Triceratops lived in herds, much like many of our modern-day herbivores. Living in groups offers many advantages, such as protection from predators and opportunities for social interaction. Drawing parallels with creatures of today it seems quite plausible that these ancient beasts chose the safety and companionship of the herd over a solitary existence. So it seems our Triceratops friends may not have been the loners we once thought. Let's delve deeper into their possible family life. Imagine a day in the life of a Triceratops living in a herd in the late Cretaceous period. As dawn breaks the herd stirs from their slumber. These herbivorous behemoths start their day grazing on the lush vegetation that envelops their habitat. Ferns, cycads and horsetails are their breakfast of choice. In harmony they move as a group, their three-horned heads bobbing rhythmically as they browse. The Triceratops live in a society where the young are protected and nurtured. The adults form a protective shield around the juveniles, their massive bodies and formidable horns serving as an effective deterrent for any would-be predators. This behavior suggests a family-like structure, a testament to their social cohesiveness. The Triceratops diet is not their only fascinating trait. Those iconic horns aren't just for show, they're tools for survival. Imagine a T-Rex, the apex predator of the time, looming on the horizon. The Triceratops wouldn't scatter in fear, instead they would rally together, forming a wall of horns and frills, ready to defend their herd. And it's not just predators these horns come in handy against, they may also play a role in the Triceratops' internal dynamics. Picture two adult Triceratops, their horns locked in a test of strength and dominance. These interactions, though seemingly aggressive, are part of the complex social fabric of the herd. After a day filled with grazing, social interactions, and the occasional defense drill, twilight descends. The Triceratops herd starts to slow down. The young ones huddle close to their elders, seeking warmth and protection. As the stars begin to twinkle in the Cretaceous night sky, the herd settles down to rest, their bodies forming a pattern of silhouettes against the fading light. As the sun sets, our Triceratops herd settles down for the night, a day in their life complete. They sleep under the watchful eyes of the adults, their dreams filled with stories of ferns, cycads, and horsetails. Their day might seem simple to us, but for the Triceratops, every day is a testament to their resilience, their unity, and their will to survive in a world that was both beautiful and dangerous. So, what have we learned about the family life of a Triceratops? We've taken a fascinating journey into the past, unearthing insights about these herbivorous giants. We explored the possibility of Triceratops living in herds, a social structure quite similar to what we see in modern-day elephants. This behavior would have offered them protection against predators and enhanced their chances of survival. We also delved into their daily life, shedding light on their protective behaviors particularly among adults towards their young. This suggests a strong family bond and a sense of community, adding another layer to our understanding of dinosaur social structures. These insights not only enhance our knowledge of Triceratops, but also provide a broader perspective on the diversity of dinosaur behavior. Each discovery brings us closer to unraveling the complex world of these ancient creatures. While the mysteries of the Triceratops continue to captivate us, one thing seems clear. These ancient behemoths may have been more social and family-oriented than we ever imagined.